First of all, then, Max, congratulations on the win. Got a clean sheet as well. How are you feeling after the game? Uh, yeah, no, it's good. I think it's been a, obviously it's been a long time since we had a clean sheet. Like, I think we played all in all competitions, maybe 15 games a season, and this is our first one. So, yeah, we're buzzing, delighted with the clean sheet. For us, defenders, Maka, uh, like defensive midfielders, like uh, Dutchie, we low Cav. Um, we're, we're delighted with that more than anything because we, we deserved it, I feel like. But finally getting it, it um, takes a bit of pressure off us as well because now we just push on and try and get a run of them uh, like going forward. So it's good. Looked like you could have got a second as well there for the Spitfires, yeah. but um, it, it never came. Does that put any pressure on you as a defence to try and keep uh, hold of that clean sheet? No, I wouldn't say it puts pressure on us. It just means that I wouldn't, say, I wouldn't call it pressure, I just like we, it kind of forces us to be a bit more concentrated because we know that the clean sheet is going to win us a game regardless of whether we take the chances up, up top or not. But listen, the forward players have been excellent, like they've, they've got us draws, results at times where maybe it didn't seem like we were going to score in last minute, equalisers, goals, coming from behind, all of that sort of stuff. So. I think uh, yeah, sometimes they're gonna have gonna have uh, missed chances, and as long as we keep solid at the back, then we'll be fine and win the game, or at least at the very least get a point. But today we scored, so we got the win, so it's good. How important is the win today after obviously the loss of Chesterfield? Yeah, I think it's very important that we bounce back from that because that was um, probably the most painful loss we've had this season. Obviously, every loss hurts, but because we've gone away um, to obviously second in the league and. We probably should have, well, I think we deserve to, to at least draw um, and we could have won the game. Um, I know their, their lads were saying after the game that we were the best team they played, played this so far this season. So it was, um, it was hurt, it, was, it hurt a lot and it was good that we reacted from training, like from the training sessions and now today to win. Um, it shows the character we have in this, in this squad. Um, and, and how much the gaffer believes in us and, and all of that sort of stuff, so it's good. Looking ahead as well, how important is it to get the win and a confidence boost today as you go into an FA Cup clash against Bournemouth, who are now top of the league, actually? At uh, oh, I didn't even realise they were top. Um, but, yeah, it doesn't really matter to us who's top, who's bottom, who's middle. It doesn't actually, like, no, we don't really care. We don't look at those sort of things. The gaffer instills us with that mentality that it does, we can go against anyone in this league and obviously if we beat Bournemouth, uh, God willing we beat them, even if, if we get a League 2 or League 1 club, we can. the gaffer believes in us and we believe in ourselves to beat them as well. So yeah, we don't really look at any of that sort of stuff, it's just numbers I guess, like anyone can beat anyone um, and we know that we can, we can, especially in the form that we're in, we can definitely win there, like we're confident in that, um, not just me but everyone. Like associated in that squad and the Gaffer and Jace and Roscoe, like we're all confident in ourselves. So um, it'll be a it'll be a like tough test, but we'll do it. I think we'll do it. So yeah, brilliant. Thanks very much, Max, and congrats right. on the win. Thank you very much.